Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So a couple months ago, I just went like bebopping into Old Navy, totally on a whim, and I was so impressed with the quality of the merchandise that I found that I decided to do a video on how to look expensive on a budget featuring their fall and winter items. Now that we are getting into the spring season, like thank God, hallelujah, <laughs> the warmer weather is coming. I wanted to do another type video to showcase what they have coming in for spring and summer. We've got 14 outfits to go through today. And I actually went to two different stores on two different occasions just because I wanted to get my hands on like as much merch as possible. Everything you see in today's video is gonna be listed and linked down below. I have it easily categorized according to things like, is it an outfit involving white denim, blue denim, dresses, skirts, pants? So let's go ahead and get into it. So the first thing I tried on were these Darling Red Pixie Pants. Now, these are one of their best sellers, and truth be told, like I have never even really tried on their Pixie before. Now, this is their traditional mid-rise, and one thing I will say is that these suckers, at least I found, tend to run really, really small. <laughs> so normally, I'm a four or a six in pants and jeans. I had to size up to an eight to get a good fit. Once I found my size, I found that they were just super comfortable. Like they have such a nice feel to them. And I love pairing reds with pinks. Like pink looks are trending like crazy for the spring and summertime. I love like that modern, very like streamlined tonal vibe that you get with an outfit like this. And of course you can easily pair them with something like a classic white shirt. I loved this one just because it had like a little bit of texture to it, just to give it enough zing to keep life interesting. And then the second time I went back in, I actually discovered that they released the Pixie in a high rise, which I tried on in the navy color. Oh my lord, these are perfection. Now I just went with my normal six, they fit like a glove, the inseam was perfect for me, and normally with like old navy jeans and pants, the inseam just always tends to be off. For reference, I'm five, four and a half, so normally I need like a 27 inseam. These were perfect, same comfortable fit as the red style, but again, these just had a higher rise. So if you're into a higher rise, definitely check out the updated version. They still have the mid, but now they have the high. And of course, with the other trend for spring being so strong in the nautical type looks, I had to try these on with this darling little vertical striped top. You guys, this top literally was on sale by the time like you accounted for, I think it was like a 35% off sale when I tried it on. This top was $10, like, oh my gosh. That's one thing I'll say about Old Navy. If you see something that you like, just wait for it to go on sale and then pounce on it. Like their sales are amazing. I just love this look, whether it's for work, weekend date, dinner date, like anything you have coming up on the horizon. This is such a classic cohesive look that's totally on trend for the spring. Okay, so before we get into white jeans, one thing I did want to point out is that in every single outfit that you see, I'm wearing the same shoes. Those are from Old Navy and they're actually stain resistant and water resistant, which I find <laughs> absolutely fascinating. Now they do have that block heel, but I found it to be really, really comfortable. I mean, I was in that dressing room for a while, so I was standing on my feet for a long time and I was good to go. Okay, so let's talk about white denim because white denim can be problematic for many different reasons. Now, one like trick to the trade I can share with you is when it comes to white denim, size yourself up, like one size or two sizes. I sized up to a six for these. Normally I'm a size four in jeans and I found that it was a much better fit. To be honest with you, I probably could have even gone up to like an eight just for like a slightly looser vibe. But in any event, I gave them a little bit of a cuff because they were running longer on me, at least for my preference. But again, like the fit was there, love that crisp white look. And then one thing I totally appreciate is the fact that you could not see like the seam of the pockets 
which can be an issue with any type of white pant or white denim. So uh, two thumbs up for that, <laughs> for sure. And then when it came to styling them, into like those nautical vibes with the navies, the blues, the grays, like they're definitely heavy on the whole nautical thing <laughs> for spring and summer, which I love, especially with a white bottom. You know, one thing too I wanted to point out about all of these tops that I paired with the white jeans, just like really nice fabrications. Like it had a nice give to them. They moved with your body. Like they didn't feel overly baggy. They didn't feel overly tight, true to size. Like they just did a really nice job of nailing the fit and silhouette of each of these. Okay, so next, moving right along to the traditional blue denim. Now, these were the mid-rise pop icon skinny. I typically don't like a mid-rise. I like them <laughs> as high as possible. But these I found to be, like, really comfortable. They sat, like, at a nice um, place right on the waist. Nice stretch. Liked the rinse. And then when it came to styling them, you know, again, just carrying on with that nautical theme. I love the blue and the white striping. I just think it's like such a fun, crisp look. And then, of course, along those same lines, love the way these look with this white crochet detail top. Oh my gosh, like you're seeing this a ton at Old Navy for spring probably for summer too. Like just very feminine, soft touches, especially when it comes to crochet detailing. And I loved this cream top. And then another surprising find was this knit blazer. Now this is a Ponty fabric. And in my last Old Navy video, how to look expensive on a budget when we talked about fall and winter, I fell in love with their Ponty pant. And I found that the blazer was just as comfortable. Like this is such a nice modern take on the classic blazer. You know, sometimes blazers tend to fit like a <laughs> burlap sack. Like you totally get linebacker vibes. They just have the big shoulder pads. They bulk you up. They're boxy looking. And this knit fabrication, guys, like it's really, really good. It's comfortable, but it still gives you that polished structure. So it's kind of like the best of both worlds. And I love the detailing, like the lining just makes it so much fun to wear. Okay, so before we get into the skirts and dresses, if you like what I have on, this actually was from a similar video I just did, but I focused on Amazon clothing and it was all skirts and dresses under $35. <laughs> one of the outfits I featured so I'll link it like either here or here so you can check that out when you get a chance so old navy dresses and skirts oh my gosh my spirit animal love what they have coming out for the spring and summer you guys so beautiful like just these really simple but beautiful cuts beautiful silhouettes I fell in love with this olive sleeveless dress oh my gosh, huge surprise to me that olive is a major trending color for the spring season because normally I think of olive as being like appropriate for winter and fall, but anything like safari related is definitely on trend for the warmer weather. This is just a simple dress and I love its elegant simplicity. Whether you're wearing this for daytime, you're jacking it up with heels and nice jewelry for date night, like the possibilities with a dress like this are totally endless. And then again with the nautical theme, this is so sweet. This little white and blue striped mini dress. Oh my gosh, just absolutely darling. I think these types of dresses are so much fun. You always have the option of layering on something like a denim jacket. And I found that this just fit really, really nicely. It wasn't too tight in the bodice. Super breezy, super fun, and again, just like one of those versatile pieces that you can easily dress up or down for any number of occasions. Oh my gosh, you guys, and then this floral midi dress. Oh my god, <laughs> I saw this hanging on the rack, and I just like made a beeline for it. Beautiful dress, oh my gosh, totally in line with like that romantic boho vibe that is so strong these days. Now this did have smocking in the back, so it just has that really nice give to give you a perfect fit, fit like a dream, true to size. I'm wearing a size small. And again, I just love how classic this is. I mean, you could get away with wearing this to a summer wedding reception, baby shower, use it for your engagement photos, wear it on a random Tuesday. Like the possibilities again are just 
endless. It's a beautiful dress. And of course the midi length, we are seeing that like it just, that midi length is not going away. And thank God, I love it so much. It is my favorite length of dress and skirt. And speaking of which, they also had this leopard print midi. Oh my gosh, so sweet, so kicky. You just pull this guy on, you're out the door. It did have like a little bit of an elasticized waistband. And honestly, I just grabbed one of their basic black tanks, tucked it in, did like a slight little blouse to it, and I was totally good to go. Okay, so finally we have this knit jumpsuit. Can any of us survive without a knit jumpsuit? I literally cannot. <laughs> coming out of my ears in my closet. <gasps> I love them. This one, so amazingly comfortable. It's knit, but it still looks like really polished, pulled together, and just again, like a nice clean line. You know what I mean? Jumpsuits are so much fun. I dress them down, I dress them up. I do not hesitate to jack a jumpsuit up with heels and some nice earrings when I wanna go out on date night or go to a special event. And of course that black color is so timeless. Like this just fit like a dream. Oh my gosh, it felt so good on. That fabrication is so, <laughs> it's so soft and comfortable. It's almost like a cloud with a little bit of butter thrown in for like that perfect fit. You just don't want to take it off. <laughs> Okay guys, so that is it. I hope you enjoyed. You're gonna have to let me know in the comments down below like which of these 14 are you eyeing the most? And again, everything is linked down below. It's all categorized. It literally is just click the link, you're there. And I just wanna encourage you guys to like, if you are on a budget, do not buy anything at full price. Like just kinda like, what I do is I make a Pinterest board, what I call my wish list, and I pin pieces that I love, and then I will kinda like obsessively stock them from time to time to check to see if they're on sale. Like Old Navy is constantly running sales, they've got the super cash promotion. So believe me, they're not lacking for the excuses they give us to create those beautiful outfits that help us all look expensive on a budget. Who doesn't love that? But in any event, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one and are having a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.